Hey everybody, thanks for watching A Guy Doing Stuff. I'm Adam, and today I'm going to be making a decorative pattern for my cedar strip canoe. First of all, everything about this pattern is tedious and complicated, and if you're building your first canoe, I would not recommend doing anything like this. I figured I'd go ahead and show you guys how I did it anyways, though. First thing you do is glue a bunch of strips together. The thinner strips and more variation you use, the crazier final design will be. On one side of your strips, you glue 4x4 four four squares with 7 inches between each one. Each square will ultimately end up making one pattern. When that dries, cut a 45 degree angle like this, then cut that in half. Take the squareless half, put a couple notches in the right place so you can clamp it, then glue that to the square like this. Again, wait overnight and you'll end up with this. Now I trim the sides and send it through the planer to clean it up a little bit. Now this is where it starts to get complicated. I use a straight edge to draw a line and freehand cut it on the table saw. Then I use the fins to make it square at about two and a half inches wide. Then I re it to get a book match effect. Now I send these through the planer until they're exactly a quarter inch thick. Go back to the table saw and rip them into half inch strips. You need to be extremely careful on this part because the strips are super fragile. I carefully run a bead and cove pattern onto each strip, and when I rearrange the strips, it ends up looking like this. This is what it looks like after I put the patterns on the side of the boat. This took a ton of extra work, but I'm really excited to see what it's going to look like when the boat's all done. You could use this method to make all kinds of different patterns, and you could use it to make something other than a canoe. If anybody uses this video to make anything, I'd love to see what you end up doing, so feel free to tag me on Instagram. Thanks for watching A Guy Doing Stuff. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch me build the rest of the canoe.